believe I busted that one. I think I hit him high, so I'm gonna, he's up here moving around. I don't know. I believe he's done. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Lord, man. He come through that brush over there. I thought he was gone. And then he finally came up here and gave me a shot. Well, I shot one right up there. I think it's a little eight point, but uh, he got the kicking around up there. He come all slid all the way down this hill. He's laying right there. Can you see? Let's get in there and take a look at him. <laughs> that is a big old body on that buck right there, boys. I hit him. Uh, I hit him right through the shoulder right there, it looks like. But he kicked and flopped around there forever, and then he got to that edge and come straight down the street, which is not bad. Boy, he stinks, too. I'll get him out down here and get a better look at him. Look at the body on him, man. Look at the, He's a big old body. Which these deer in here usually do have big bodies, but uh, but yeah, he's a nice one. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I'll take him. <laughs> he come. Somebody run him off of a, or I guess somebody. I don't know. He come. He come running off this other farm over here. And uh, got down in this brush, and his path comes out right in front of where I was at. He done just like they do all the time. Come right out, right up there, 150 yards. I, I put that. I bought that loophole CDS scope. Put it on CVA Acre, uh, the the mountain rifle. And, I raised him at 155, and I put put it on 150, and I held it right on his shoulder, and hit him right through there, right through the neck. So, I mean, it dropped him, but he got to flopping around, and rolled all the way down in this big holler, but that's all right. I mean, it's a uh, it's pretty good haul out of here, so. It's all downhill though, so that's a good thing. Thank you, Lord, for an awesome hunt and an awesome morning.